dear. Oh, no, no. Star, what's wrong? Ice is falling from the sky. It's awful. The trees will get sick from the cold. What villain could be so terrible? Ice? Oh, you mean snow. This is no time to correct me, Nightwing. Earth is in great peril. We have to do something. Star, calm down. How can I calm down? This is normal. What? It is? Yeah, it's cold winter. It snows every winter, and after some time it stops, and spring begins. Wait, so this isn't the evil plan of a villain? It's, no, it's cold seasons, and winter's just beginning. And how long does it last? Um, three to four months? What? Star, you need to calm down, please. The trees are losing their leaves. <laughs> it's a normal thing. Please, let me show you that winter's actually pretty great. Great? I can't even use my full powers. Right, the sun. But don't worry, there are good things about winter. Seriously? Seriously. Well, all right. Come on, let's call Beast Boy. I'm sure he must be having a lot of fun. Well, okay, but what can we do? Oh, there are a lot of things. Like? Like, um... Uh, Beast Boy will know. Oh, okay, let's find him then. Hey, what's up, guys? I was just telling Starfire about all the fun you can have in winter. Oh, it's super fun! You can be a penguin! Or a woolly mammoth! Yeah, I was thinking more of, you know, fun you can have when you aren't an animal. Uh oh. It's so cold! How can you have fun in this cold? Relax, Star. There's lots of things you can do. Like this. Hey! <laughs> See? What was that? It was a snowball. Here, take some. Hey, I'm not the only guy out here. <laughs> here, have some too. We could have a snowball war. How does one have a snowball war? Basically, we throw snowballs at each other. Like a food fight? Yeah, but with snowballs. Oh, okay. A lot of fun, but the snowballs were awfully cold. Hey, come on! The war is over! <laughs> okay, okay. What can we do now? Oh, I have an idea. Tell us about it. Well, I've got these blocks of ice. I haven't really done anything with them. So maybe we could do a sculpting contest. Like a building challenge. Yeah, but with ice. Here, you can fix some more in case you want to fix something. Okay then, so we have three blocks. We can all use one and see what we come up with. The best one wins. That sounds like fun. Okay then, everybody think of what they want to do. Okay, okay. I think I got it. Me too. So fast? What can I say? I'm a creative girl. That's the spirit. Let's begin then.
All right, then. I'm done. Me too. Yeah, I finished mine too. I bet I'll win. Wow, that's something, huh? How did you make this so fast? Oh, uh, I have some experience ice sculpting. You know, I once lived some. I once lived with some polar bears and. Polar bear sculpture? Oh, this one polar bear did. It was mighty blue of the polar bears of. I might have said too much. What do you mean? Uh, it's kind of a secret. What is? The existence of the ice sculpting polar bears. Oh come on. No one will know you told us about it. Oh, they'll know. They watch a lot of YouTube. You know, when they're not ice sculpting, there isn't much else to do in the Arctic. Right. Well, it's an awesome sculpture. It really is an amazing work of art. Thanks, guys. It means a lot. Let's see yours. Is it one of those firebirds from your planet? Well, yes and no. How come? It's a legendary bird. On my planet, there is no winter, but we have legends of a time where everything was ice and not fire. Back then, the mighty ice hawk reigned supreme on our planet, and everything was ice. But I'm sure you find this very boring. That was awesome. Yeah. How did your planet went from? Eyes to all fire. Oh, it's a long story with epic battles and terrible decisions and amazing things. Well, how does it go? Um, the hawk went into a volcano and really liked the hot temperature. So, so it figured it would prefer to be a fire hawk instead of an ice hawk. It made fire all over the place. Oh, that was unexpected. Yeah, the mighty hawks of my planet change opinions a lot. All right then. Let's go to Nightwing sculpture. So here it is, my sculpture. Is that your symbol? Yup. Way to be creative, dude. Hey. I like it, Knight. So why your symbol? Well, I never told you about how I decided my symbol and costume. Yeah, how did you? Well, like any other superhero, things happen. Tragically. No, I read in a comic. A comic? Yeah, a Superman comic. You see, he has a bottle city, and when he goes in there, he doesn't have powers. So one time he wasn't there, he decided to try the whole vigilante business, but without powers. He took on the name of a mythical bird of Krypton, the Nightwing. Wow, that's actually pretty cool. And you're not the only one that knows about this. Well, Superman must know about it. And Batman? And、uh, Batman doesn't read much. Well, that was a good contest. Yeah, I'm starting to like this whole winter thing. Now we only have to decide which one of us won. I think it's best we leave it to the audience. Good thinking. So, what do you think, guys? Which ice sculpture did you like the best? Please let us know in the comment section below. Leave a like and a comment for your favorite one. All right, we gotta go. We look forward to your comments. Night out.